All right, enough of that shit. Let's go. All right, Batten, how you doing? As I just typed in chat, I'm in a bit of a mood today, so we'll see how this goes. This could be fun. This could be not so fun. <clears throat> it's um one of those days where my wife's like, oh, you have nothing planned. So uh, we're just going to try and fill your day with a bunch of bullshit that you don't want to do. Just had the chimney sweep leave. Had to uh, slam my lunch as quick as I could. I thought I was going to have to push the stream off till three. After the first game's done, I'm going to have to run upstairs and shred a big piece of chicken for her. So, have a little bit of a break between games one and two. Bo Coach King, how you doing? Welcome in. We are uh, our second year with this franchise, but only our first year in Utah. And we are in the World Series against the Phillies, man. So, was not expecting to win the division. We had a miracle run the last week of the season, and Texas shit the bed against the White Sox, went on a tiebreaker, and then we just ran through two rounds of playoffs, beat Minnesota in four, swept Kansas City in four, <laughs> and now we get the Phillies. So this is the thumbnail, Burns and Wheeler. So this will be, uh, be fun. So we got Burns and Wheeler, Garcia, Suarez, Freed, and Sanchez, and this will be Estes against Nola. So, anyway, um, let me check their roster again for injuries because I think they have somebody out. Um, let's go this way. Yeah, Alec Bohm's out for the year. Spencer Turnbull's out for the year. So they they don't have a third baseman on one of their relief pitchers. Yeah, I don't do college football anymore because I hate that fucking game. <laughs> I, I tried it, Coach, for three weeks, and then I uninstalled it from my PlayStation. Um, and there was so many other people playing that game now that everybody was coming up with their own way to recruit, and that was cool. But I hate the gameplay, so I uninstalled the game, and I have no desire to play it. And I'm burned out on 14, so I haven't really played that. So... so and I don't want to play Madden because that's garbage. It's the same. It's slower gameplay. I mean, college football is Madden just sped up, right? Uh, what I hate about the gameplay most is you can't throw the ball downfield without getting picked. Your offensive line is irrelevant because when they want to block, shed, and sack you, they will. Um, it became repetitive. Drags and slants and nothing downfield and recruiting became repetitive um, so yeah, I lasted three weeks before I shit can that game. So I, I have been in a much happier mood not playing that game. So anyway, so we've been dedicating ourselves to playing this game. So that's what we're doing. All right, enough of that. Let's get in, get this game started. Cause like I said, I have to go shred a piece of chicken before we get to game two. Um, what are they going to wear? They have red. No, they don't have. Yeah, that's their alternate home. Let's make them wear their alternate homes. <clears throat> yeah. Um, yeah, the whole game is trash. Here's my custom ballpark that we made. <clears throat> oh, here, um, Batten. I started another one. Um, just barely got started with this one. It is uh, Labatt Park in Montreal. Spectre! <laughs> welcome, welcome, man. So, hey, Batten. Um, at some point next season, no, it's not for the Blue Jays. We're going to move Tampa Bay to Toronto. <laughs> so, one of two things. We're either going to move Tampa Bay to Toronto or I'm going to move Washington back to Toronto. I'm sorry. Montreal. We're going to move either Washington or Tampa Bay to Montreal. And we're going to have a new ballpark for them to play in. And we're going to name them the Expos. Exactly. We're going to bring back the Montreal Expos. But we're not going to do it on 24. We'll save that for 25. 
that'll be my second franchise for 25 not the one i start with so that'll give me plenty of time to make the stadium i just barely got started but yeah this is my tampa bay one so um if i decide not to move tampa bay and i move washington back then we'll put tampa in this ballpark yeah i almost wore my expos hat today um so anyway um, i'm gonna be switching back and forth between controllers because i forgot to charge my second controller and i've been playing all morning and uh i burned up my I burned up my main controller dicking around trying to quickly rebuild the uh blue jays i traded away everybody but vladdy and they're struggling <clears throat> so all right let's get this going yeah it's not it's not a whole lot of fun right now i did oh 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 while this is loading check this out for that toronto this was one of my drafts so i got this guy eduardo sixto who's an 86 potential and a 70 something overall in the first round right the very top guy listed they got him in the first round the sixth round is this elvis gonzalez sixth round 94 potential 70 overall shortstop he was discovered but i couldn't scout him i had to go right into the draft so i just took a flyer on him in the very last round yeah he i moved him to second base because his feeling is shit. but he's already got 67 and 77 contact as a as an 18 year old <laughs> so yeah here's his card yeah that's what he's walking in with and he can steal bases he has great vision discipline and clutch that is a sixth round pick <laughs> so yeah oh. st louis franchise we're trying to win three in a row and like in may 1st or something Mike Trout needs to average 159 hits for two seasons to get to 3,000. And I think he only needs 10 home runs for 600. So I'm going to play two more years with him, just sign him to one-year contracts, and try and get him his 3,000 hits and his 600 home runs. I had to sign Jordan Walker to a big $25 million per year contract. So like I said on uh, Discord, I'm not going to be uh, bringing in, that is not my plan to bring in anybody big for this team next year. I have a list of players right here that we need to trade away because they're not going to play in the majors and uh, they're making six to seven hundred grand and uh, I want to ship them off for a younger version that makes 60 grand. I also need to cut um, six or seven players because I had a big, uh, you know, big draft class coming in, and I got to clear some space for these guys. So two of those guys are free agents. I can just let those guys go as free agents, and then I have five other ones I need to trade away. So I'm going to try and use those guys and make some two for ones. Try and get some good, uh, good younger prospect position players because it's not going to be easy drafting them where we're going to be drafting from now on. Um, I only have three big free agents: Sinzel, Yarborough, and Dwayne Underwood are free agents. <laughs> so. It's going to be pretty much just general house cleaning and housekeeping on the minor league side. And the major leagues are just going to go with what we got. Man, 
I will say the NFL yesterday had some absolutely ridiculous fourth quarters between the Vikings and the Bears and the Cowboys and the Redskins. I'm not saying Commanders. Um, they uh, they had some just ridiculous drives late in the in the game and and uh, get there, get there. How did he beat me? Thanksgiving, we're going to my mom's. Usually we have a people at our house, but this year we're going to my mom's. Let her deal with it. The only bad thing is, is um, she's not going to have the football games, but whatever. Only one. I don't care about the Dallas and uh, Giants game, so it's just the first game and the last game that I care about, and I'll be able to watch most of those. Yeah, expect I can watch the early game at home, and I can watch the late game at home. It's just the middle one. I, I don't care. I uh, beat the living shit out of this dude th this week. So in our football league, we have 12 teams. We have 12 teams. So you have 11 opponents. So you play 1 through 11. And then the last three weeks, you repeat the first three teams that you played. Okay. So we have like eight teams that are fighting for six playoff spots. And of those eight teams, I am the only one that has six games against three of those teams that are among the eight. So myself and three other teams so half of the teams that are fighting for the playoffs i have to play three of those teams twice one of the guys at the top he doesn't play anybody that's already in the playoff hunt twice he plays the three shit teams t twice each he's the luckiest motherfucker i've ever seen um and no one ever scores points when they play against him and then when he does play someone like me, then Jalen Hurts loses his mind and runs, you know, gets 30-something points. So I'm very salty about it. <clears throat> but if I, uh, I already got revenge on my week one loss, and I kicked the living shit out of that dude, um, he beat me in week one because the Bears had do two defensive scores, and I lost by eight. So... I picked up the Bears defense and played him against me this week. It didn't matter. I kicked his ass and I had Jalen Waddle on the bench. So 27 points sitting on my bench, but it didn't matter. I had Gibbs, A-Chan, A.J. Brown, Nico Collins, Kittle, Janu Smith. My team's fucking loaded. I still had T. Higgins on a bye. <clears throat> so... Anyway, so now I get to play the guy I beat in week two next week. And then the week after that, I play the guy that's currently in first place. And he won the league two years ago, finished second last year. Can't stand him. Nice guy. Can't stand him because I don't like when people win all, all the time. Who am I taking tonight? I don't really care because I have no one playing. <laughs> not a fan of the Ravens. But I'm also not a fan of Harbaugh. I do like I do like Herbert, so ah, get foul and it's not. Couldn't get that ball inside enough. So Yeah, 49ers, they just have too many injuries. Really good team, but way too many injuries. You know, McCaffrey, Ayuk, Debo misses time, Kittle misses time, now Purdy's down. It's just, it's one of those seasons. Um, it's just one of those seasons, man. Harbaugh was in the NFL before. He was with the, um, he was with the Colts, wasn't he? Chiefs are just sandbagging a little bit on offense. They're just doing what they need to. They, they're saving Kelsey for the playoffs. They don't need to run him into the ground. They're also sandbagging with uh, DeAndre Hopkins, so they don't have to pay a higher draft pick. 
You're just going to limit his snaps and then turn him loose in the playoffs. <laughs> Don't swing at that. The 49ers. I know he was. I know he played for the Colts. I thought he was with the Colts before them. Yeah, the only problem I have with the Lions is I have Jameer Gibbs, and so I always want Montgomery to get dinged up and leave the game, not get hurt out for the year, just. Play half a game so I can get all the stats out of Gibbs like I did this week. I can't stand when he gets those one yard touchdowns. So get the fuck off the field. There you go. We gotta work the count with this guy. I'm so busy talking about football, and not even paying attention to what I'm doing in this game. Oh, that's a shot, but I don't think he got all of it. It's going to be an extra base hit. Oh, it's going to be out of here. Wow. That did not come off the bat sounding like it was hit hard. It certainly didn't. wasn't perfect, perfect. I didn't hear the whack. All right, Tyler. Chiefs, uh, they, they took Carolina lightly. In Carolina, like, you know, when you're playing the best team, you want to, you always want to beat them and stuff. No. Took my hands in to pull it. Ended up shooting it the other way. All right, Jared, can you go deep too? The wind is blowing out straight away center field very, very briskly. So we got to keep the ball down because they can hit the ball out too. Both New York teams are almost always awful. <laughs> No, I flinched and he swung. Damn it. All right, at least we got to run. Tyler gets us on the board. I tell you what, regardless of what his ratings are, he plays well in the game. <clears throat> I think I uh, shortchanged him in my A's franchise. He could have been easily first base, DH, left field. Ooh, cup check. Right in the nuts. Yeah, Daniel Jones is not good. They should never, never pay him. They should have just let him go and sign somebody else. Um, the person they should have kept was Saquon, though. But, you know, he had injury problems, too. So, running backs, you never know, man. Never know. You never know. Rodgers should have retired from his uh, Achilles last year. But I'm sure he didn't want to go out that way, but now he's going to be one of those guys that hung around too long and put a little tarnish on the end of their reputation and their career. Hey, if you watched the show Receiver on Netflix, you knew Devontae was going to get out of there. Even if, even if Rodgers was not in New York and he was not playing at all. You could tell by the look on his face during that season he wanted to leave. <laughs> he was not going to be there long term. That was a stupid signing. He should have just took a little less and stayed in Green Bay. You're saying all the right things to the media because you don't want to be, you know, that guy, but we know. Ugh. <clears throat> I 
Three. Tried to go up and get that. Missed. All right. Five strikeouts in three innings. We got to make a little better contact. All right, Pete. You tore it up last round. He's the uh, leading guy for the American League playoff MVP. All right, Rosario should have had an infield hit last time. Yeah. <sighs> Take a break here for a second. Um, I'm going to say it right now while you guys are in here. Um, I said it on Discord, too. We win the World Series today. We will not have a a wild off season where we're going after more guys to try and win the back to back. I'm going to come back with essentially the same team, maybe a little tinkering in the back end of the bullpen or the bottom of the bullpen. Um, we've got pitchers in the minors. that can come up and pitch pretty soon. Um, we've got plenty of good hitters. We got a stud second baseman about ready to come up. He could actually come up and help us out in left field, first base, third base. He's, he's got a lot of position flexibility. Um, and we get into next season, I'm going to move all of my best prospects to AAA. And we're going to do more simming on the major league level and more full games and player locks down at AAA with those players. Because um, those are the ones I'm most interested in for next year. Um, doesn't mean we won't play any major league games. Maybe it's only one a month. And we'll sim the rest and spend more time in the minor leagues. That's more interesting to me than doing it again with this team. Plus, the less I play the, the Major League team, the better chance it is that we don't repeat. So, you know, because if I win the World Series two years in a row, we're just going to be done. <laughs> I'm not going to play anymore. We'll go do something else. So, if we lose this year in the World Series, then I'll, I'll play more games on the major league side but if we win it first year out then i need to focus on the young guys and developing them um, get over him god damn he's been robbed twice Ooh, try to back door him. There we go. Yeah, I didn't even expect to win the division. Wild card would have been fine, but win the division and then sweep the ALCS. And this is crazy. And this isn't like it's a completely loaded team, like like the Cardinals in Oakland were. I mean. Getting Burns and Freed was very, very helpful. I also think Alvarado and Rasmussen in the bullpen have made a huge difference, right? So we can stop those rallies before they get out of control. So just the pitching we added made made the difference because we already had decent enough hitting. Adamas gave us another 30 home run bat, but it's not like we signed Soto or something like that. I mean... Mayo, we traded for Mayo, but he's he's not, I don't even know, if he's barely an 80 overall if he's that. And it's not like he's got hit power and contact in the 80s. Kelnick isn't, ooh, what a play. Tumbling catch. Kelnick doesn't have ridiculous. He's got good splits against righties. Um, Pete Crow, he's just speeding defense right now. Butler was already on the team. Soderstrom was already on the team. Langoliers was already on the team. We added Rosario at second base, but that's after we traded Geloff to get Mayo. Um, Mason Miller was already on the team. So we got a lot of pieces that were already on the team. There we go. Get down. He's going to have to hold up. So, you know, if I went out and added a couple of more pieces, we would be... 
you know, we would just keep winning. I'd like to see some of these other younger pitchers make it up. Hey, Batten, I just did the draft for the uh, Blue Jays. I had the fifth pick overall, the draft after the one I showed you. And there was, I didn't want to take any more 18-year-old high potential pitchers that are going to take five years. So I took the best closer in the draft. He was a 79, 70, 77 overall with 89 potential. I took him with the fifth pick. He's and I moved him from closer to relief because his his uh, pitching clutch isn't as high as it wanted to be. And so he's uh, he's going to be in the majors at 22, and he's going to be like our fourth best reliever. <laughs> I was like, you know what? I don't care. I'm just going to take this guy right now, and we're going to have a cheap guy that we can have in the bullpen forever. And I think he's left-handed. I was paying $5 million for Rayleigh, and I'm going to let him be a free agent, and I can pay this guy 60000 And uh, I have him for six years. Oh, guess who's a free agent in my Cardinals franchise next year? Pulse Kings. <laughs> yeah, might have to break the bank. I don't know though, because I'm I'm I have bring. I'm up this. Oh, Thomas goes down and gets it. I'm gonna have to uh, bring back Trout at like 30 mil, 25 mil for one year. What's up, tight spot? How you doing, boys and girls? That's our second home run. Soderstrom hit a long one to right center field, longer than that one. Bam! He just went down and got that slider and yanked it. Ooh. Yep, I'm chilling here too. The wife's gone to work. Thank God she was driving me crazy this morning. You should do this and you should do that. Oh, I had the chimney sweep scheduled to come today. And I'm like, man, I had nothing planned today at all. Nothing. Just go to work. Leave me alone. So we'll do the off season tomorrow, but it'll probably be later in the day, like three. Ooh, that's a double. Soderstrom with a home run and a double. Get down. There you go. I'm hoping the off season is only a couple hours. Usually a third baseman snagged those. I'm kind of shocked he didn't. All right, Kobe Mayonnaise, let's go. Ooh. We sweep the World Series, I'm going to end up doing two double shots. <laughs> I'm going to be at day drinking and lit up. My controller's low. My other one's on charge. I'll, I'll swap out after this batter. I'm just going to have to keep swapping them back and forth as we go. He's going to catch that. But he's running away, so... Yeah, the Angels are trying to get better because uh, their owner's not that young and they're tired of uh, watching LA kick their ass yeah, I can see this one isn't charged up either hold on
sure the cord's plugged in because neither one of them charged. Ooh. All right, no pop-ups, no strikeouts. Just get the ball past the pitcher. Forgot there was two outs. I was thinking sack fly time. Doesn't matter. We're good. It's three nothing after four. Edge of the track. I wish they had include the yellow line at the top of the wall. It's really annoying. There's no reason for it, too. This is the guy that got the hit off me. Are you guys going to finish that season for uh, NWO, or is the game just giving you guys too much trouble with the disconnects and everything else? Because <clears throat> every time I watch you guys play on, on stream, you disconnect. It's like you guys have gone three weeks in the last two months. Where's Lou been, man? I haven't seen Lou in weeks. Ah, swung over it. Good hold, good hold. Just got a piece. Out front on that cutter. Let's not sit on the inside. Let's sit over the middle now. There we go. Ball four. Work the walk. He's not going to be in this game for too long. He's going to be out of here probably by the end of the sixth. Yeah, they give an MVP chance for a PCA. <clears throat> Right now, it'd be Soderstrom in the World Series, or Adamas. One thing they don't do is ever give it to a pitcher. Like if I threw two shutouts in the World Series, I probably still wouldn't get an MVP. <clears throat> um, I don't think we did. <clears throat> Oh, by the way, with Toronto, the first year I played with Toronto. Spencer Horowitz wins Rookie of the Year, but he doesn't get me an extra uh, PPI pick because he's too old. And he drills him. That'll help us on base. And he's out of the game. In the fifth, where Keedy comes in. There's nobody out in the fifth, and Zach Wheeler's out of the game. And that's going to be a double play. Should be a triple play if he steps on the bag. That was a triple play. Hold, hold, hold on. It's a triple play. Look, Rosario grounded in triple play. 5-4-3 triple play.
And he said he stepped on the bag. And he touched the bag with his hand. He didn't step on the bag at all. And right around the horn for a 5-4-3 triple play. Wow. <laughs> World Series triple play. You don't see that very often. Man. Arkady comes in, throws one, one pitch, right? And gets three outs. That's a hell of an inning. I've never seen a triple play in MLB. We just saw it in the World Series. Fuck you and your foul balls. God damn. Again, <laughs> there we go. Jesus, eight foul balls. And then he's going to get a double. Here we go. Pips around that. No runs allowed. <clears throat> Don't swing at that garbage. Still can't believe we hit into a triple play. That's going to be down. Is that to the wall? Yeah, we're going to hold him up. We're going to hold him up. If that was Pete Crow, he would have scored easily. Yeah, Trey is still at shortstop. He's going to be there until he's 50 because of that dumbass contract. Come on, quit swinging it. Bullshit. Yeah, I would never sign anybody that's 30 years old anything longer than a three-year deal. Even in this game, once they hit 33, it's a one-year contract. And if I got a guy that's 29 or 30, they're definitely not getting a five-year, much less a 10-year contract. That's way over his head. That'll plate two. 
Adamas joins Soderstrom with the uh, home run and double, although Adamas now has four RBI in this game. That was a rocket. Tyler's like, all right, all right. I'll just have to do you one better here. Just stayed alive. Yeah, they still have both Harper and Turner. There we go. It's only going to be a single. He needs a triple for the cycle, though. <laughs> we traded this guy the first season. I think I had him in the ro A's rotation until like the trade deadline, and then we shipped him out. Or maybe it was after the season was over. I know he was like the highest rated pitcher on Oakland in the uh, set the uh, the roster file. I think that's two double plays from Mayo. All right, Jared. Been playing stellar defense out there in left field. See if he can get you on base. This team is nowhere near as good as my Rockies, A's, or Cardinals franchises. We're just, I know part of it is the ballpark, but we're, we're killing it even on the road. But the ballpark's also hurting our pitchers because free gave up 35 home runs this year ah we're gonna strike anyway but we are not gonna do anything but roll over and ground out on that pitch all right he wants to live at the bottom of the, of the uh strike zone we just need to wait for the pitch Gonna drop. Damn thing almost hit me. There's Trey Turner. Too, too much down and over the middle. That was supposed to be up and in. <clears throat> We're lucky that stayed in the ballpark. Yeah, please run on his arm. Could not turn to tough play. Now we turn double play. No runs allowed. Thank you very much. <laughs> Couldn't get it on the first one, but we got him on the second one.
What am I doing? That's why I like I do like relievers that can throw a sinker. We can come in, get out of a jam. I know that was Burns, wasn't a reliever, but good four seamer, a sinker, slider, change up. Reached early. I was trying to foul that off. Booing, we're up six nothing, motherfuckers. The ball went a long way. I didn't hit it well. <clears throat> All right, Rosario's zero for three, and he's been robbed twice. I'm glad we're already up six runs. There's Ware and Kelnick out. I don't think Butler's had one ball today. Maybe one. Maybe one. Shallow fly ball. And he's going to get his second double of the game. Not sure he's gonna throw a complete game or not. He's getting tired. He's got 99 pitches. Yeah, he's probably just gonna finish this inning. There you go. Hit it well, but the ball just carried too far. All right, Brent. Hmm. Way out front. That's a mile high. <clears throat> Thomas, three hits, single, double, and a home run, just like Soderstrom. And now Soderstrom going for four for four. Just missed. Just outside the bag. Three. 
That was a filthy pitch. Back foot slider. All right, we're going to make two changes here. We're going to take Kelnick out and put in Esty because he's much better defensively and much faster. And then, new pitcher. <clears throat> Let's just go Rasmus and get it over with. Four, six, and too slow on the turn. Fucking Rosario took forever to get rid of that ball. Ooh, almost got a force out at second. <laughs> almost. Game one in the books. And that's the winner! That's the winner! Change the uh, stream title. Corbin Burns and Willie Adamas kind of uh, took it to him that game, didn't he? And and uh, can't forget, Sodosham got us started. He got the game-winning rib. These transition screens take forever. God, I feel like I'm playing Madden. All right, Butler two hits, Rooker one, Adamas three, Soderstrom three. Both hit a home run. Both had a double. Nobody in the bottom half of the order did anything. Burns five hits, no runs, no walks, five strikeouts. So, there we go. Another inning of shutout relief by the bullpen. They've given up four runs the entire playoffs. All right, another home game. Yeah, they're going to go gray this time. It's because I'm uh, pitching so well, Specta. If I pitch well, they don't score. <laughs> they do not score. So, um, you know what? We're going to put Pete back in center field. And we're going to let um, Adamas bat. And we're going to put Soderstrom all the way up at two. Because he has good contact, but not as much power. And Adamas does not like lefties. But I'm not going to put him in behind Crow, Pete Crow, because I want I don't want him to clog the bases. Although if we get Pete on in front of him, then his clutch would kick in. So yeah, let's do that. All right. 
Ooh, so Nevin is out. Um, all right, so I guess Esty is in. So let's make this lineup move again. Okay, there. Thomas Butler Sutterstrom, you there. Yeah, all these lefties in a row. Yeah, we'll just go with it. We'll just go with it. We can always... Um, there's probably going to be one inning where they bring in a left-handed reliever. Yeah, specifically for those three guys. All right. This guy has been okay, but not great in the playoffs. Let's see if we can keep these guys in the ballpark. There we go. Plus, that makes our defense better because Adamus is better at short than SD stronger arm. And Ruiz has better defense in the outfield. <clears throat> so. The speed really matters out there much more than it's short. There we go. Soderstrom scoop and tag. Two down. Two, three, first. Let's go. Good pitch. He's trying to foul that off. <clears throat> All right, Ahmed. Damn. He's been hitting the ball hard, but right at people. Yep. Hold on. I got to put a timer. I got to go shred some chicken that's in the crock pot in half an hour. Timer. Start. All right. So when that alert goes off, I'm going to pause and go spread the chicken. Ah. I'm going to do much of that anyway. All right. We'll just look low. We'll foul off the upper half pitches and attack the lower half pitches. <clears throat> Once the pitch down, we'll set our sights even lower, go down and hit it. And it gets me. This guy's going to be in the ass. down and hook that into the corner. Not where I wanted that ball. Up there. <clears throat> I 
Got the wheels on Ruiz here. He's not fast enough. If that was Pete Crow or Esty, we might have got there. Good throw across the body. It's two down. Way out in front of that. All right, lazy fly ball. We pitch around the leadoff double. There we go. Didn't even move up. All right, let's get the sticks going. Let's go. Come on, Sugar Shay. You've been quiet lately, dude. We need you to blast one. Wind is now blowing in from left field, so. Probably should drive it out to right field. <clears throat> this must live over there. Right over his head. All right, Nikki, we brought you in specifically to dominate left-handed pitching. There we go. That'll do, pig. That'll do. <clears throat> All right, Larry. And that's a double play. Oh, he booted it. He's going to get nobody. Trey Turner with a crucial error in the bottom of the second inning. That might open the floodgates. We got bases loaded and nobody out for Soderstrom, who has been hot, hot, hot. Not going to have the pop against lefties, but he has better contact. So we just want to drive the ball through the infield. Stay back. A catcher has 74 speed at third base. So we've got speed at pretty much second and third. First, not so much. <clears throat> Even a double play should give us a run unless they go to home first. Juve just got this that. Just got this that. All right. Just look down, 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 down. He wants to double play. Oh. But he's going to ring me up. He's living down low. Beat it. Oh, I don't know about that. I don't know about that. We got the lead, but I don't know about that double play. All right. The error did come back to bite him because that was going to be a double play. And they would have been out of the inning with no runs. Chase. <clears throat> Let's try it again. God damn. He's killed us. That's three hits, two games.
Got him. High heat. Let's go. Painted. <laughs> there we go. Strike out. Strike out. Way out in front of that one. All right. Another. Pitching around the base runner. They have not scored in 12 innings. <clears throat> Get through. There we go. Adamas, another hit. That's four hits in the World Series. Ball really dropped at the bottom there. He wants to double play. They're not going to double up Louise, but I'd like to get under this ball. Drive it somewhere. So he can hit it out against lefties. Hmm, just barely got a piece of that. Well, that a ball. We're lucky. I thought I swung. Oh. Rode in on me. All right. See what Rosario can do here. This is the guy that needs to hammer the fucking pitch. He can hit it through the wind. You need to get this guy to throw the pitch higher in the zone. A snag by the ball boy. This guy's living in the bottom half of the zone. Just everything is down. Throws another ball here. It's going to put the runner in motion on three and two. Yeah, I reached for ball four. No, ball three. Sorry. Ball four. Butler's not going to get there, but he can play it off the wall. All right. Been living dangerously the whole game.
Bad throw. Fuck. All right, tie game. That's their first run. Took them 12 innings to score a run in the World Series. What I was trying to do with Harper was to get him to pop it up. <clears throat> Four, six, three. All right, only gave up one. All right, time for the offense to get their shit going again. Fair ball. Come on. Come on, Shay. Right. There's a little chance in it. All right, Nick. You had a big hit last time. See if we can do it again. Yes, you do. Down into the corner. That's going to be a double. We're going to send him. And my guy kept running. I tried to stop him at second. But it kept him from throwing it home, so we got the lead, even though I didn't mean to run to third base. I was holding L1 down to make sure he went home. You know, I'll trade the uh, I'll trade the base runner to guarantee a run. There you go. Except that would have scored the run, but that's okay. It's all right. All right, Tyler. And that's a double play. This four-seamer is working well today. We're using that as a strikeout pitch, setting it up with everything else. That's at least three or four strikeouts from that pitch alone. All right, one, two, three, fifth. Let's go. Twelve more outs. Need some more runs, though. No, oh, hung that. Missed it.
Get through. There we go. Now we can steal second. Try and manufacture a run here. Extend this lead. Get Adamas. <clears throat> his clutch will kick in if I get him a second base. So his contact will go from 50 something all the way up to 86. There we go. Well, I wanted to bat him after Pete instead of front. We can get a stolen base. It can really help his contact. There we go. That's going to be a double. That's just going to be a ground ball through the hole all the way to the wall for a double. Wow. Willie is trying to get the uh, MVP, Disney. That was almost like a hit and run. Esty's got a really high clutch, too. Ah, we we're swinging at garbage. Oh, Fucking diving catch. And I took off because I thought it was going to drop, so I can't even tag and go. Unbelievable. Again, CPU with gold glove fielding always. Jumping on a nice chair to hit that. God damn. Throw a fastball. This is ridiculous. Meant over the plate. Come on. You know you wanna. Let's go. You know. Right in the wheel. House. Oh. Hardy almost snuck it inside the bag though. Oh, again. I'm waiting for the off-speed pitch and he's almost getting a fastball behind me. Now we're just bad luck. Well, I'll get him a third, but if I had been able to tag up and go, yeah, I would have scored a run. All right, Rooker, you're due. You are due, buddy. Is it going to drop? Of course not. All right. Willie gets us another run. Welcome back. Willie Adamas just got another RBI. Trying desperately to get the uh, MVP of the World Series. We finally gave up our first run of the World Series after 12 shutout innings. And then we give up a home run to stop. Well, at least we uh, extended our lead last half inning, so it's not a tie game. Leave it alone. It's foul. Chase. All right. We got just under seven minutes left before I got to go shred that chicken. So shouldn't take me that long. Oh, 
Come on with this bullshit throw. It's fucking Trey Turner. So now he's going to steal second. <coughs> of course he goes on the on the curve ball. And it was a ball. I don't mind the walk. He sets up a double play. Got him. All right, it's two outs. The eight location. Good, good, good. Thank you very much. Give up a leadoff home run. Survive the other bullshit. He's done. <clears throat> All right, we beat up on our Kiwi last game. Now we got a righty in. That's very helpful. Yep, it's game two. I think we lost, what, game two against Minnesota? We haven't lost a game since. We've won eight in a row in the playoffs. Yeah, I was trying to golf that. bring in Mayo. He pitched in relief. He came in for uh, Wheeler. That's why we bring in Mayo, because he hits righties way better than Senzel. Yeah, he's a starting pitcher. He's just pitching in long relief. They do that a lot, especially when their bullpen isn't strong. Like, I try to put together a really strong bullpen so I don't have to do that. But computer will throw a starting pitcher in that long relief spot. And then he'll get 100 innings pitched out of the bullpen. All right, Tyler. You need a hit right here. Ah, swing it over the changeup. <clears throat> yeah, if you could park one. Fuck you and your change-ups. Two minutes. After this half inning, I'm going to go do the chicken. Get it out of the way. Before we get to the last three innings. He's five foot one of uh, 
She's 5'1 and thinks she's 6'5. I'm twice her size. So she's like 5'1, 115, and I'm 6'3, 235. There we go. Draw that one. So I'm like double her size. <laughs> We're going to stop the timer so it doesn't go. And as soon as this half inning's over, we'll go take care of the chicken. All right, PD, let's go. Find a gap somewhere. Nah, don't swing at that shit. He loves to throw that change up down. Wait for a pitch up. Ugh. Cannot lay off it. I just want to go out and drive it to the gap. Alright. Now playing third Number sixteen. Bringing in Alexis. And I'll be right back. I'm not even gonna put on the sign saying I'll be right back. I'm just gonna mute the mic and I'll be back. All right, that didn't take long. Oh, 
Ooh, way to chase. Diaz coming in, throwing flames. Got him. Finally. Oh, and then he just flips that slider in the center field. No problem. No problem. Try to back the one. Not again. Go foul. Thank you very much. Wish this guy had a change up. did get the backdoor slider that time all right six outs to go and we'll be up two games to nothing in the world series <clears throat> all right offense let's go well he had two hits against the lefty pitcher which he doesn't do uh usually very well against lefties so Working hard at getting World Series MVP. Ah, fuck. I swung at his arm, not the pitch. I'm leaving SD in just in case he gets on so he can steal. There we go. That's going to be a double at least. Maybe three. We're sending him. He's going three. There it is. One out triple. Oh, yeah. Don't have to steal or bunt him over. Now we just need to get the ball out of the infield. Hmm. Late. Rookers on deck. That'll do it. And that's just going to sneak on by for a little, oh, about a 120-foot single. Wow. That just barely got by the bag. I swung way over the top. Look at that. If he's playing back, that's an out. All right. Got at least one insurance run. Yeah, let the pitch get up, man. That's going to be in the corner. I don't think it's going to score a run. No, nope, we'll hold him up. We'll hold him up. Sack fly, I'll get the run home. All right. Come on, Shay. Oh, trying to drive that to the right. Ground ball to the right side. Oh, they're playing in, so we're going to have to get it to the outfield. How 
How's that for get it to the outfield? <laughs> that was over the uh, concession stand, wasn't it? Goddamn right, Spectre. <laughs> he just golfed the shit out of that one. Let's see the replay. He knew it was gone right away. Let's see. I want to see where this ball lands. Oh, the stat cast is going to cover it up. Get that shit off the screen. Nope, just shy. I thought I hit it over the thing, but I ended up hitting it into the back of that. Well, that blew the game wide open. This was a one-run game. That was a shot, man. Kobe's trying for another exit base hit. All right, there's two down. That takes a lot of the pressure off. I don't have to bring in my setup guy. I can bring in one of the other bullpen guys, and I'll have everybody well rested for the uh, game three. It says rookie. It's Hall of Fame pitching and legend. I'm sorry, Hall of Fame hitting and legend pitching. Yeah. I don't like what it does on legend batting. Everything is like, they, they never throw it over the plate. It's all around the edges and they get the fucking calls. So I'm just like, just, screw it. That's why we don't play a whole lot of games. We only play a little bit until we get to the playoffs. Come on, Larry Butt. I don't even care if he gets on. I want to get these six outs. And then he just flips that into left field. Look at that. It was basically a one-run game all the way up until this half inning. All right, Tyler. You're actually due, man. Adamus is running ahead of you for the uh, MVP. Oh. I am trying for home run here. That's why we're swinging hard at everything. Ooh, just missed another double. And he hit him, asshole. All right, Petey. You've been the playoff darling up to this point till Adamas went nuts in the World Series. Rode in on me. <sighs> Come on, let's go. Yeah, I swung right over that. Come on, dude. I'm actually trying to get the inning over with, man. Throw a fucking strike. Here we go. I want to get six outs and get out of here. <clears throat> Sugar Shay. Golf that like a left-handed batter. All right. You are out of here. We've got you guys saving Rasmussen. Let's bring in Sandlin. It's his first playoff game. I think for some reason he wasn't on the uh, staff for the first round. You know how the computer likes to set your playoff roster when even when it's set to uh, manual. Get there, Esty. 
Yeah, one down. Two down. Four outs to go. There we go. Buck Farmer. Well, he's had five hits in two playoff or two World Series games. He's up to 314 for the playoffs. Oh, I swung too early. point we just need outs to get out of this come on SD is it gonna get down no he's gonna get there there we go don't mind that quick half inning let's get to the ninth Salen's thrown eight pitches Let's go to Miguel Castro. One down. And that's going to drop. Good throw gets him. He's out. Wasn't a very strong throw, but it was accurate as hell right on the bag. Butler using his speed to get there, turns and whips a strike. One hopper right to the bag, and he's out. There we go. Pop it up. There it is. There it is. Update the title. That's nine straight playoff wins. Shea, three for four with three RBI, three runs scored. He's got nine playoff RBIs now. Adamas has 10. Garcia pitched out of trouble multiple times. Bullpen still did their job. That's three more innings with no runs allowed by the bullpen. Amazing. And Nevin is back. Okay. Save this game. All right, Max Fried and Christopher Sanchez, another lefty. All right, you're going to go there. You're going to go there. And Pete's going to go in there. We're going to bet 
Willie ninth again, so he can bat with some people on base. And that works so well. We'll try it again. Stott is not in the lineup. Brett Wisely is in the lineup. <laughs> Maybe Wisely hits better against lefties, I would imagine. Yeah, 427 ERA, 1.7 whip. That's not good. Overcast looks a little misty. Come on, SD. You got this. There we go. That long windup is never going to result in a still uh, caught stealing. That is way too long. Way too long. Since we're up two games to none, we're going for third. And he's in. There we go. Put the ball in play. Get a run home. Ooh. Wind is blowing in from left center. Kind of across. Like from the left center to the right field corner. Of course. So the only guy that we can't hit it to. Come on, Rooker. God damn it. Now it's going to get caught. Why couldn't we do that with either of the last two batters? I'm fucking real. Last game, Max pitched. He only got it five outs before he got hit in the head with a ground ball and knocked him out of the game. Good throw this time. Thank you. You're out. <clears throat> Come on. Get on your wheels. Thank you. Two down. Ball one. Up. All right. Uneventful first inning. 
on, Nikki. He popped it up. Just got under it. No. Be patient, man. Why are we just swinging at the first pitch? I'm taking this one. Yeah, that ball's rain back in on me. I thought I was going to make better contact than that. Just couldn't reach it. Ooh, why was that not a strike? Got him chasing. There we go. <clears throat> it's that stupid green shin guard, Bryce. Oh man, a good throw and he's out. I should have thrown it to the relay guy. Yeah, I saw that. Need a big strike out here. Oh, come on with that fucking bullshit animation. It was right to him. I absolutely hate the defense in this game. It is so fucking bullshit. They make gold glove plays all over the goddamn place. Their pitcher is out there like a fucking Patrick Waugh on the mound. Can't get it past him to score a run in the first. There's a ground ball right to first and a 
takes a bad hop right over his glove. Fucking predetermined bullshit. Ah, couldn't stay fair. He beats that out easily. Don't chase. I'm sorry, we've won eight straight playoff games in that nine, and this counted the first round. <clears throat> Just run this pitch count. That's all awesome. <laughs> Turnabout's fair play, huh? And we outlasted him and got a hit. Here we go. Yeah, I'll take that. Gapper is going to score two. It's still only one out. Jumped at that change up. <clears throat> Ball just kept cutting in on me. I want to take strike three. And that's a double play. No, we beat it out. There we go. That's going to bring up Mr. Rooker. Come on. Need a big fly here.
He's not going anywhere. Now that second baseman, Brett Wisely. Hee-haw! No ball, one strike. Again, a good throw gets him. Fuck. Come on, guys. didn't swing and we didn't get the call. Ball. Take a walk. Kept him in the park. They just barely place it in front of our guy. We never get that. We never get that. They always race in and just grab it knee high. Fucking game. Why did that not show up? The the first base hmm. The emotes are not showing up on screen even though they're supposed to. Two. 
Hell of a pitch. And it's going to be out. We got to get the bats going. Keep that runner from moving up. Lucky that stayed in the park. Jesus. Always an adventure. Now we can steal our way around. At least get him a second base so Adamas can bat with his clutch high. I'm taking this pitch. I think he's going to pitch out. All right, Esty has good clutch too, so either way. And got him a third base. Scratch out a run here. that I'm 
There we go. That got us a run. All right. Back to a one-run game. Ah, way early. Come on. See the pitch. Don't swing at the arm. Really worked his pitch count this inning. This will be his last inning. And he, oh, he doesn't catch it. How fortunate is that? Rooker comes up now. All right, let's go. Hasn't done shit in a while. Why are over there? His his speed is 90, but his steal is 43. No, that's a ball. Yep. Specta. I know EA has some people at San Diego. What the fuck? It's a routine ground ball! Fuck! Come on, game! That's twice this game alone. He's now catching it. And that's going to be a run. That would be a man on second and two out. That's tw <laughs> Come on! What the fuck? Now, 
Now, uh, why are you swinging at that? The bat, the center center center. Center. Yeah. Yeah. That's the That's a ball. One ball, no strike. Ball two.
thought they were going to call that a strike. All right, Willie, got your clutch activated now. Let's go. No double plays. See the ball. Oh, fuck me! I just said no double plays! swinging at that pitch. Rookers on deck. I'd really like to draw a walk here. What a pitch. And the guy in first went all the way to third. It's a tie ball game now. All right, Shay, you went deep last game. Got another three-run blast in you. Don't chase. Don't chase, man. Gave away the at bat. At least we tied the game. All it work and we give it right back.
Don't throw me that high fastball. I will tomahawk the shit out of that. Come on, Larry. You're due. Big fly. Right here. Ah. Get that out. Pull that ball, he goes to third. All right, Tyler. Come on, buddy. You got this. You got this. Got PD on deck. Adamus after that. Tried to hold up. Didn't matter. Would have been a strike anyway. <laughs> Ryan Kirkering. All right, now I get an extra step here. Not heat. Hey, Batten, in my Cardinals franchise, I added Kirkering to the bullpen. We let several of the main bullpen guys go. Matsui and Romero, I think. Kirkering's the one of the big setup guys. I don't care if Adamas comes up. He's got more power. <clears throat> Extra base hit's going to be two runs. And we hit it on the ground. Wasted, wasted, wasted. That's his third error. God damn.
That's the ball. Two balls, one strike. Ball three. Two balls, one strike. Safe. There we go. Finally, we beat the fucking pitcher to the bag. Probably because he's left-handed and fell off the third base side. No, this guy's got 83 contact. I want him swinging. Plus, in this game, you're more likely to pop the ball up than actually put the bunt down. <clears throat> so if he walks him, that's two guys on for Rooker. Desperately trying to get the double play in here. Now the strikeout. That's the ball. Take your base. Still wants a double play. We have two 90 speed guys on base. Oh, we popped it up. And we can't advance because it's too shallow. If that was back by the track, I'd send them both. All right, Shay. We need your power here, buddy. Outside. Who's on deck? Mayo. Okay. Oh, got it up in the air. Not deep at all. We can't advance. Now we need to hit. Get out of play. Ooh. 
And we're going to lose because of three fucking errors by our second baseman. This is fucking bullshit. I'm benching him. No, that missed. That's a ball. Hold on. I got under it. Damn it. His wheels do me no good if I pop the ball in the air. <clears throat> I need line drives, ground balls. Butler's had a rough playoffs. He had a nice home run earlier in the playoffs, but he's hit into bad luck lately. Joey has pitched well in the playoffs. Oh, of course, our guy doesn't knock that down and throw him out. <laughs> because, you know, this game is not balanced. Ninety-nine fielding, ninety-nine arm, ninety-four reaction. He can't get to the ball and lets it get by. Not to mention he has ninety-nine speed. I hate this fucking game. That missed, that's the ball.
because the wind is dead. It's not not uh, blowing at all. So no help. Straight away center field. I didn't hit it perfect. Perfect. I'm still pissed off at the fielding in the last 10 innings. He'll track that down. This Castiano says wheels. Yeehaw. Hey, he didn't fucking eat it up. At least he caught the ball and threw him out. Wow. Miracles never fucking stop. Our first round pick, Fiori, might go straight from double A to the majors next year. That's what I was waiting for. I actually like this controller better. And it didn't charge either. What the fuck is going on with my controllers not charging? That's a ball. Three. I have a special white one. It's got these grip covers for the uh, joysticks. And uh, it just generally feels better in my hand than the black one does. Damn, it's right down the middle. Smoked it. That's essentially a double. And we're going to need that because SD has great clutch, but we got to get him in a scoring position first. He's safe. He's fucking safe. Because my guy tagged his, his foot. <sighs> I 
God, I hate this game. One ball, no strike. One and one. You know, if that was Nolan Arenado, he would have dove and the ball would have went all the way down the line, right? We saw that in the Cardinals all the time. He would fall down and it would just be by him into the corner. So inconsistent. I don't understand this game on defense. Back in the day, I used to just put it as CPU defense. I wouldn't even play defense. I would pitch and the computer would play defense. Oh, of course it goes foul. He'd have been safe by 20 feet. Jammed. Ah, swung way early. Come on, man. Get through. There we go. All right, on the board. much since game one. Always ready to fuck up. Put that ball there. Oh, 
Got him. Come on. Hey, what do you know? We didn't boot the ball. Fuck. Damn, barely got both of those last two pitches. Just got enough. Turned on that one just a little bit. that pitch. He's going to catch that. Just not having good barrels in this game. Just not. Just, just keep missing on the bat. <laughs> right through my pitcher. Never goes right through their pitcher, does it? It might bounce over their pitcher, but it doesn't go through them. Can't get the double play.
Let's try this again. It. Fuck! All right, we're stealing third. He's not going to make another throw. Tie ball game. Manufacture a run. Bunt, steal, steal, sack fly. Oh, why would I swing at that garbage? This game's tied. Hey, I was in my... Uh, late teens and 20s back in the 80s with Whitey Ball, so I know what that exactly looks like. Get on, steal, doubles and triples, not a whole lot of home runs. Six, six switch hitters. <laughs> Pitching defense and then just driving them nuts on the base pass. don't do enough of it now fucking stat nerd heads you gotta swing for the fences every damn time Nineteen fucking foul balls, and then ah, uh, let's hit this one out. Fuck you, Harper. One and out. No, we're gonna hit you. That hit him. That hit him. Yeah, fuck off.
one strike. Wow, under his glove. Don't see that often. Now pitching for the Phillies. Number 46. Buck. Shut up. Still thinking about that home run. One ball, no strike. Now pitching for the two. Number 56. Somebody outside, who knows? The younger one is the the patrol dog. She's out there barking at everybody. Oh, 
didn't get enough of that, though. Fuck. That's two deep shots to center field. <clears throat> Come on, Petey. Two for two. Find a gap somewhere. If he gets on base, I'll pinch run with Adele because I'll have 90 speed then at second base. No point in pinch running right now. Holy shit! That should be a home run! That hit the fucking shrubs! That's over the wall! That's a home run. That's a home run. That's beyond the wall. How is that not a home run? I got to play the computer and the game. <laughs> All right, Kelnick has 66 speed. I don't think Esty can hit one deep enough. So I want to score on a ground ball or something. Oh. What's up, tight spot? Thank you for the raid. How was your uh, stream? We're getting fucked by the CPU. Here, look at this tight spot. We're down by a run. We are down by a run in the eighth. Pete Crow Armstrong hits this. And they didn't give him a home run. It hit over the wall. And they said it was a double. <laughs> That's going to score two runs. Fuck you, Philly. That was a contact swing. I had circle instead of X. <laughs> Just put the ball in play and it gets a run. Well, it actually gets two. And now we're going to go for another stolen base. Ruiz has 99 clutch, and it came in on that play. And he's safe. I'm stealing third. Fuck this. I want another run. There we go. Ah, swung way out in front of that pitch.
That was a nasty pitch. Those last two ate me up. All right. Come on, Brent. You're the big boy, and you haven't done a damn thing. We haven't hit a home run in this park yet, although we should have. Pete Crow got totally robbed. Just got to that. Fuck you and your bunt. You're not as good as us. Sit down, Turner. Suck my dick. Finally get to use Mason Miller for the first time in the series. Number 64, Andrew. Yeah. Now we're just hacking. Remember, Corbin Burns goes next game, so if we can steal this win, we can finish him off with Burnsy. All right. Come on, Kobe. All right, three outs, three big outs. It's either going to be tied or up three to one. Lots to go. Good job. Way to go. <laughs> Ball hits the fucking bag. At least it stayed in the infield.
He went. One out. One out to go. Slider away. Fastball up and in. Got him! Yes! Fuck you and the CTU. And that's a winner! That's a winner! Bunch of bullshit. Between the three fucking errors last game and this bullshit here. Hold on. I hate this shit. I don't want to see any of this shit. What I want to see is this. One more time because it's such goddamn garbage. We're losing three to two at this point. Three to two. He smokes this ball over the left fielder's head. Hits the fence above the wall. Beyond the wall, right? That should be a home run. No, double. Again, bullpen gave up no runs. All right. We are one win away from a World Series in year two. First year in Utah. First year that we've actually played the games because we sim the whole first year. And it's Corbin against Jesus. We got to beat Jesus. We got to beat Jesus Lazardo. They're not coming back with Wheeler, huh? They're going with a five-man rotation. Wow. Hey, it's finally clear skies. Burns is a little tired, so we're going to have to use our bullpen on this one. And um, you know what? Play Joe and right, Lawrence and left. And um, could have played Mayo instead of Senzel, but we're going to go with the splits again. What I didn't check was who the leading person is for a World Series MVP. All right. It's his first appearance in the playoffs. And it's game five of the World Series. Instead of Zach Wheeler, they're going with Lazardo. This is our third left handed pitcher we've had to face this series alone. Oh, that's off the plate. Don't chase. Don't chase. Oh and one. I just said, don't chase. What do I do? Swing at the very next fucking pitch. 
I don't care where this pitch is, we're taking it. I'm taking a strike. <clears throat> We will be back for the off-season stream tomorrow, probably 3 o'clock, late afternoon. I'll take a four-pitch walk, thank you. Five straight balls. You sure this is the guy you want to pitch in game five? Not Zach Wheeler. Get the fuck out of here. Go. Over the wall. Wind's blown out, too. Yeah, I got to change this. Remember, we had to win our last six games, including three at Texas. And they lost two out of three against the White Sox the last three days of the season for us to tie for the division lead. Burns has not allowed an earned run in the actually at all in the playoffs. He threw two two complete game shutouts and he threw eight innings his last start. So he has not allowed a run in the playoffs whatsoever. He should be the playoff MVP. And if we throw another shutout, he should be the World Series MVP. All these bunts. Trey, you gonna bunt too? Easy first inning. Gotta love it. Gotta love it. I have a feeling about this game, guys. I have a feeling about this game. We have so many first-round picks on this team. Ours and from other teams. Kenelnik and Senzel were not drafted by the A's. <coughs> Man. <coughs> Swallowed spit the wrong way. Stay fair. Stay fair. Stay fair. Yes. <laughs> I 
and played the draw right around the tree, right into the middle of the fairway. <clears throat> it's the first home run we've hit at this park in three games. That's a leg. That's a speed double right there. <clears throat> Ooh, didn't go for the curveball. All right, I'll take the walk. It might be his first walk of the playoffs. Come on. Pinch controller. Why are they not charging? Fuck. God damn, why did I forget how to pitch this inning or what?
Hawk. Well, that was a nightmare inning. He's definitely not going to go uh, deep into this game. He's got to quit hit flying balls, man. The wind is blowing out. We just got to get the ball in the air. <clears throat> Can't believe he cut that off. Mm, trying to shoot that the right. Hardy. <clears throat> One ball, two strikes. Mm. That was the pitch. No swing, huh? Yeah. Uh -huh. 
center fielder, Brandon Mark. Well, he's in the lineup. Absolutely crushes lefties. <clears throat> Woo, almost killed the pitcher. <laughs> 114 miles an hour right past his back. All right, Joe, you went deep last time. Oof, on that shit. You better not hang this. Mm, good pitch. Didn't hang it. Made me chase. Ah, and then I chased again. Fuck. Gave away that at bat. That was a walk. All right, Pete. Waited too long to swing. Schwarber runs 900 yards to catch that ball. Good sliding. Sliced and diced that half inning. Holy shit. <clears throat> Jeez. 
Jeez. <clears throat> oh, SD goes deep. <laughs> It's like Vince Coleman going deep for the Cardinals in the 80s, man. Doesn't happen very often. He's the steel guy, not the home run guy. <laughs> he crushes lefties, though. Bam! That was a towering shot. To the back of the stands in the lower... Deck in left field. Holy shit. Wow. Wow, it's going to drop and we're going to have to hold up because I wasn't paying attention. Otherwise, he'd be standing at second base. I wiped my eye. I thought, oh, he's going to catch the ball. All right, Rooker, you've been MIA. I'd rather say yippee ki -yay. Let's go. Hit the fucking ball. Ah. Uh oh, is that good enough? Nope. You want the wind blowing out? Ah. Come on, Shay. Turned a little too early. Good pitch. <clears throat> All right, Nick. Esty Ruiz. We had three solo homers in this game after barely hitting any in the first four games. Well, he rebounded from that second inning, didn't he? I didn't think Burns was going to get anywhere close to six innings. This is carving him up now. That was a weird little cue ball shot to third base. Yeah, he's going to be done after this inning. We got to get him out. All right. Did your job. Five innings. What's up, K Money? How you doing, man? Hold on. Let me switch out my earbuds. See if I can hear myself. Nope. Hold on. Let's try this again. There we go. All right, now let's go.
Go get him. Oh, 14 and one with the Raiders. Nice. You were like six and oh, a couple days ago. You're on a warpath, man. All right, Urquidy. We got to him in the first two games. Let's see if we can do it again here. <clears throat> K Money, we are. Uh, we win this game right here. We win the World Series. Yeah. Lost by two. Reached. Just gonna flip that out there. <coughs> Fuck. All right. Joe you did your job, but now is the time for Mr. Kelnick. Now Didn't get enough of that. Come on, Pete. Let's go, buddy. All right. We've got nine outs to go on offense. And uh, I got 12, 65, 64. Man, we're going to leave Kelnick in right field. <clears throat> and God, why is Mayo feeling so bad? It hasn't seemed to matter, though. All right, we'll leave Sinzel in for now. Almost took too long. I forgot I was going to take him out after this inning. Or before this inning. There we go. We'll take him out now. <clears throat> now, Damn it. Quit falling down. Take a step and feel the ball. Why are we... I'm just throwing it to the cutoff, man. What the fuck is wrong with this game? Tried to uh, get the out at first, so I get one out at least, and then make the throw. <clears throat> I intentionally walked that batter so I could take the pitcher out. Plus, now it gives us... No, the Giants got their ass kicked. Um, so it lets me bring in a better pitcher. Gives me a force out. 
He hits a grand slam, I'm gonna lose my shit. Don't chase. Don't chase. Don't chase. <clears throat> Get a first round bye. That's good. You should with only one loss. Home run distance, but early. Trying to backdoor that on me. Fortunate to foul that off. Another foul ball. He should throw one away because I'm looking inside so hard. He would get me to swing and miss if he throws one away. <clears throat> there we go. Won that battle. <sighs> All right, SD singled last time. Ooh, trying to drop one down for a hit. Throw it to second. Nope. All right, moved him up. I was hoping he would throw to second so we could be at first. Steal our way to second and third. Because Adamas isn't going to steal. So, all right, Tyler. Ugh, it's going early. <clears throat> Adam. Five and ten made the playoffs. No, he's still playing a regular season. You're not done yet. That's right. Fourteen and one. Yeah, he's still got. Ah, I tried to pull my hands in and foul that off. You're, you're not in the playoffs yet. You're still. Waited for it. I still missed it. He loves to throw that slur. I'll take a walk here. Ah, 
Alright. Bottom of seven. Eight outs to go. Yeah, it hits me right in the forehead. I can't field it, but they field everything. And he has to come out of the game. I hate this fucking game. Well, after two years, you should have the team how you want it. I'd stick around. I did not tell him to go to the bag and step on the bag. I, I pressed triangle on purpose to throw that ball to second base. And we don't boot the ball. All right, we don't have to face Trey Turner anymore. This guy's still in the game. Get out of here or off the wall. Nope. Get him. All right, I'll take that. Man on base. Come on, Butler. Let's go, buddy. And double play. Good throw. Thank you. <clears throat> Harper's done. We don't have to face him anymore. Marsh is done. Don't have to face him anymore. Got him. Ring his ass up. Oh, come on. Thought he hit that out. <clears throat> nope. All right, we need three outs, and we are world champs.
We need some more fucking runs. All right. Seven, eight, nine. <clears throat> Kelnick, Pete. No. I forget who's at the bottom. I'm thinking of our lineup against the guys. <clears throat> yeah, it should have been a strike though. Come on, boys. One more run so that we don't lose the game on a walk-off if I get a base runner on. Mm. Mason Miller is going to come in for the ninth. At least it's not game seven. Mm, right over the top. <clears throat> Just got a piece of that. Great. All right, Willie. Can you give us some insurance? Nope. We're going to go to the ninth, three to two. Three solo homers, that's what we've had. <clears throat> Three outs from a World Series. Two outs to go. Got it up against the wall. <laughs> wow. That close. That close. Two more strikes. One more strike. One strike away. There it is. Utah Avengers won the World Series, boys and girls. Can you believe it? I can't. I cannot believe we won our first year in Utah. <laughs> it's like the it's like the Quebec Nordiques moving to Colorado and changing to the Avalanche and win the win the cup the first year. I'm letting it play out because I want a specific pitch. 
picture. I gotta wait for them to present the trophy and all that good stuff. <clears throat> Fuck man, Fred. Piece of shit. There it is. World champs. <laughs> it's not the picture I want though. I want I want the team photo. Come on. Come on. There it is. Now the funny one. our 10th World Series title as a franchise. We hit three solo homers. Corbin Burns gutted it out. He was 4-0 in the playoffs and only allowed those two runs. I think that was his first three walks of the playoffs, too. And our bullpen gave up no runs again. He's out one to two weeks. Well, I'm glad we wrapped it up so I didn't have to replace him. All right. Awards. World Series MVP is Joe Adele. <laughs> he goes two for three and hits a home run and he's the World Series MVP. That's how fucked this stuff is, man. Let's not give it to uh, the guys who played the entire series. <laughs> Pete Crow. I mean, Petey, Adamas. No, no. Joe Adele. <laughs> this game is garbage. All right. The regular awards. Vladdy was MVP. Shohei in the National League and the Cy Young. Grayson Rodriguez, Cy Young. Seager, batting title, Profar, batting title. Gratterall and Jax, relievers. Jaime Salas, he's the D potential dude, right? I did make him a C. I moved him up, so at least he's a C. I think he can go up to like a 79, because I didn't think he should <laughs> win the Rookie of the Year and start regressing right away, although that's happened in the past. <clears throat> Jackson Holiday in the National League. Did we get any gold gloves? No. Silver Slugger was our DH Brent Rooker. All right. Stats. Yeah. Let's not take the guy who had 17 hits and nine steals. Or the guy who had these two guys crushed it in the first game. Yeah. Joe. Where the hell is Joe? Two for five with a home run. He only played three games in the entire playoffs, and he's World Series MVP, guys. Here we go. Corbin Burns gave up exactly two runs in the playoffs. Yeah. We have a strikeouts in the bullpen. Alvarado, 13 strikeouts in seven innings. Rasmussen had 10 and seven. Miller had 14 Ks and six in the third innings. <laughs> so I will be back tomorrow, late afternoon, three o'clock central time ish to, uh, to do the off season. Um, and we're not going to add a whole bunch of big name guys. And I, I don't think we're going to chase anybody except maybe a bench player. If that, um, I have to clear space for five draft picks. Um, I've got two minor leaguers, 
that I'm wanting to uh, trade away with some others, like do some two for one trades and upgrade some of our older minor league guys and try and get some younger ones to replace them uh, that don't cost as much. Um, we got to make room for all of our draft picks. Um, I will rename that closer we drafted, the 90 potential closer. We'll rename him Roy Hobbs because his name is Troy. Troy with a T. We'll change him to Roy Hobbs. So Roy Hobbs will be in our bullpen. Uh, Sinzel's a free agent. Yarbrough's a free agent. Dwayne Underwood, who wasn't on the uh, playoff roster, is a free agent. So, Oh, my goodness. All right. Well, we got it done in four hours and 20 minutes. 420, Jimmy. Guess what that means. Don't have any ganja, but we got some tequila. So let's take a shot for the uh, Utah Avengers. Did what the uh, A's couldn't do at the end in Oakland. We get to fly a World Series flag in our new ballpark. Wish they would let us make that. Here we go. One, two, three. <laughs> that one did not go down nearly as smooth <laughs> as the last time. Woo. Wow. That was a little rough. That's normally very smooth, but. Wow. <clears throat> I can feel it in my nose. <clears throat> Retired players. Chris Bassett retired. <clears throat> Verlander retired. He probably is not going to make it into the uh, Hall of Fame, is he? 262 wins. He should, but he's probably not going to. <clears throat> Jordan Montgomery retired. Jan Gomes retired. Torn Achilles. He was 38. Jordan Montgomery retired. Wow. Charlie Blackman. Roldis Chapman, Jesse Chavez, Alex Cobb, Patrick Corbin, Brandon Crawford, <clears throat> Adam Duvall, Eduardo Escobar, Jerry's Familia, Kyle Gibson, Kyle Hendricks, Jason Hayward, Nobody gets into the Hall of Fame. All right. Sinzel and Yarborough are free agents, and um, he wants <clears throat> six mil a year to be a part time player. I don't think so. He is going up because he's only 30, but he's he had 300 at bats the one year, but he didn't bat as much because we had uh, a better third baseman. So great numbers, but. And a big home run in the World Series. Yarborough doesn't strike anybody out. Velo's way down. He pitched great, but only pitched 10 innings. I'm not paying him. I'm not paying him $2 million to pitch 10 innings. Uh, we need to get a hitting coach. I don't mind him because I don't drag bunt. Late discipline, contact, clutch power. Uh, we'll take the plus three power. I'll give him more. For you. And pitching coach. We don't want to see any red. He'll sign with us. <clears throat> rebrand team all right so um let me show you guys something i thought about doing this
That would be their home jerseys. Instead of the cream, all cream, it would have this gold as as their So it would look like that. Or we can just stay with the cream. I think we'll stay with the cream. <clears throat> Why did it not give me my color? Staff is fine. Calendar. Got the hitting coach. Got the pitching coach. And we are... We are not going to re-sign these guys. So I am going to advance through. And we will pick this up tomorrow. Um, we got some 40-man roster guys to deal with. Mostly Nick Kurtz, who we will put on. I'll we'll just deal with him right now. He will be up playing first base or DH at some point. <clears throat> Here's our boy, Logan Fiore. Look at that. He's crushing lefties. We need him to be able to crush righties, though. He's already ahead of Rosario, so he might start the season, especially since his defense is even better. He might start the season in the majors and platoon and bat against lefties, although I could leave him in the minors and let him play every day. Um, which would mean I would need some sort of better second baseman here because his defense killed us in the, in the uh, World Series. I really don't want to play Esty at second base, although I could, especially against lefties. <clears throat> um, arbitration... And not offer him and let him go. The free agents are Vladdy Cease. Guys, I could go sign Cease. I literally could go sign Cease because we have $92 million to spend. Hell, I could sign Kyle Tucker if I wanted to. I 
might go get a lefty in the pin. I don't need a closer. I don't need a catcher. We don't need Vladdy. Rangifo's defense isn't much better. Glaber's is terrible. Arise is terrible. Yeah, Willie Castro to play some second base. Doesn't hit much. Yeah, there's not a whole lot out here. Unless we want to go chase Dylan Cease. That's the, he would be the only person we would chase. And I don't really want to spend the money to do it. We won without him. Imagine what we'd be like with him, with 97 hits per nine. <laughs> Imagine me pitching with Dylan Cease. I guess my, I guess batting my, my answer should be, my question should be, do you want to see me pitch with Dylan Cease, right? <clears throat> How many strikeouts will we have? <laughs> Blake Snell to give us another lefty. Because you know I don't walk anybody. But he's 33. Is there anybody down here that snuck through after the draft? This is what you need to do. You need to go to the bottom, work your way up to the 50s, and then hit L2 and circle through and look for guys that are 18 to 21 and potential higher than D. Or just see where those red blocks are with the numbers. Look for a player that has nothing across that line. Like like that, right? That means they were drafted and or they weren't drafted and they slid through. So you want to go through every position and see if any draft picks slid through that's going to be young that you can supplement, especially into your minor leagues, to replace an older dude. Especially relief pitchers. All right. This is the key to getting rid of those older D pitchers and replacing them. Like this guy, he's 18 years old. He's a B potential, but he's only 46. He's got an arm, but he doesn't catch, can't hit worth a shit. His durability is 49, so he's going to get hurt. But what you, what you want to do is try and find one of those guys in the 60s. Anybody in the 40s ever. Here's a first baseman that has contact but no power. My dog's one in. Come on, girls. Keep going. You want a treat? Come on. Come here. All right, boys and girls. Sky. This guy's a D. <laughs> if he wasn't a D, he would be awesome. The guy can hit. You can put this guy in your team and put him in the minors and help your minor leagues do well. Um, What do I have at first base? Sweeney. Oh, Carter Sweeney's a dude we drafted. Well, he got cut because we have all these extra guys. Let me release Brady Brasso. And Weisenberger. Let's just get this shit taken care of right now. Brasso and Weisenberger are gone. Oh, 
Pullman is gone. That puts us at 93. We still got to cut somebody else, and that would be... BLAC. All right, now we can go back and add the guy that we drafted. But as I was saying, you always want to go through, obviously, because you're going to see guys that computer's going to cut that you actually drafted because you have too many players. So what you probably could do is before the end of the season, you know you're going to cut somebody, go in and drop their ass off the roster so that your um, draft picks have plenty of room to come in and be added to the team. This is a 22B potential shortstop. He's 22, though. But he could help in our minor leagues, right? Yeah. We don't need him. All right. Let me save that so that we have our, <clears throat> our first baseman back. And we will do all of this tomorrow. I don't need to go through it today. I want to make it its own episode, so... All right. We are done for today. We have 92 million to spend. And I could sign Dylan Cease if I wanted to, but that would mean uh, Mitch Spence, which he lost. He could end up going to the pen. Estes could go to the number five starter. These guys are not B. The B that we have are down in them. They're way down. They're not even ready. I was not prepared to do this. Spence could go to the bullpen. Not, yeah, Spence could go and Estes could stay. Jeez. Max has gone down. Garcia's gone up. Burns has gone up. All right. We'll answer this question tomorrow. I'll be back at 3 o'clock Central Time to do the entire offseason. I'm not doing it right now. Who can we go raid? Because I need dinner. Man Cave. I wonder if he's still going to be playing when we go in there. But we'll raid Man Cave. And if you want to watch all of the nerdy stuff as far as the offseason, come back tomorrow. We'll take care of it tomorrow. Let me see what he's doing. Looks like he's actually switched over to... Looks like he's got out of the park, which is a really cool baseball sim game. So I'm going to start the raid. You guys are ready. We'll head on over to Man Cave. If you want to do this nerdy off-season with me, come back tomorrow at 3 o'clock Central. We'll go through this. And we'll decide together if we're going to sign Dylan Cease or not because I have plenty of money. I can offer this dude 25 mil a year if I want to. We don't have anybody that's young enough that's going to need a contract that big. So we can, we can shove on these guys if we want to and try and win back-to-back. All right. Thank you very much. Appreciate you all. And uh, I need food and you guys need to go cheer on Man Cave and I will see you tomorrow. You guys have a good rest of the night and um, go Chargers, right? Mm -hmm.